Today we're going to show you how to align multiple vocals instantly in Studio One 5.4 or later using the VST ARA version of Vocaline Project 5. If you're using an older version of Studio One, please refer to the Vocaline Project 5 manual for instructions. This video is to help you get started. More in-depth tutorials can be found on our website. First up, let's listen to what we're working with before we do any processing. Don't you whoa. As you can hear, there are some obvious timing differences between the doubles and the lead vocal, which we can fix in seconds with Vocaline Project 5. Now we need to select the vocals that we want to align together. In this case, that's a lead and six doubles. Once our tracks are selected, we click on Audio in the top menu and then Edit with Vocaline. Vocaline Project 5 should then appear in the dock under your arrangement. Next, let's transfer our lead and double vocals from Studio One into Vocaline Project 5. In Vocaline, we call the lead vocal the guide and the tracks like doubles, backgrounds and harmonies as dubs. Select your lead or guide audio in Studio One and then press the capture button next to the guide label in Vocaline Project 5. It's also possible to simply drag and drop your guide and dub audio from Studio One directly onto the Vocaline Project 5 display. If you're working with multiple dubs, we recommend you select a suitable preset in Vocaline Project 5 before capturing, as once your dubs are captured, further processing changes get applied to each dub individually. Now we select the dubs in Studio One and then click Capture next to the dub label. You can now see the dub waveforms have been successfully loaded into Vocaline Project 5 and are shown here in orange. Once your guide and dubs are captured, newly aligned audio outputs are automatically created and returned to Studio One. The new outputs are shown here in yellow. You can also see the blue outline of the guide placed over the top of the outputs so you can quickly compare how similar the signals are. As we said previously, once you capture your dubs, any changes you make in the Vocaline Project 5 plugin will only be applied to the currently selected dub. To change the settings for an individual dub, select the dub track in Studio One and adjust the settings in Vocaline. You can always check the dub you are processing by referring to this label here. As we're using the ARA2 version of Vocaline, the audio in Studio One has been automatically updated. So to audition, we just need to press play. But first, let's listen to how our vocals sounded before. Don't you, whoa, don't you, whoa, build an ocean for you, an ocean for you too, ocean for you. And then after being processed by Vocaline Project 5. Don't you, whoa, don't you, whoa, I'll build an ocean for you, an ocean for you, ocean for you. Great, that's sounding much better. So once you're happy with the results, simply render your audio in Studio One by selecting Bounce Selection so your newly created files are saved with your project. It really is that easy. Now all that's left to do is to listen to our newly processed vocals in context. Hope that's been helpful and please visit our website for more tutorials.